Hi guys, it's Ryan Share here with the new 3.7 version of Dex 3. New in this version is the new text, video, and image overlay feature, adding to the video mixing capabilities already present in Dex 3. Today I'm going to demonstrate that for you a little bit and how it works, but the purpose is to allow you to create image overlays or video overlays or text overlays or a combination of all of the above. They're multi-layer overlays. And here's one of the finished products I created really quick uh, before I started shooting here. It's not my birthday, but I figured it was kind of relevant. So as you can see, you know, I've got a couple layers here. I've got a video looping in the back. I've got uh, a PCDJ logo and some text. So let's jump right in and see how you can create similar or probably better overlays. First thing you're going to do now, right now, at the time of shooting this video, uh, we are in beta of 3.7. We do plan to add a button on the interface to access the video overlay builder in the options now, which is located in options now. You'll also have the ability to select any of your pre-created overlays from a drop-down menu on the interface. So you can quickly load any overlays on the fly. And overlays, since you can set the level of transparency for everything, can actually show up over Sorry. videos. You know, so if you're playing a music video, you can actually show the overlay and not just when you're playing, let's say, regular audio or even karaoke for that matter. So to get to the new video overlay builder uh, and the options, you're going to go into Dex3's options. Click options in the top right corner of your screen. When the preferences menu loads, we'll bring this down a little bit so you can see uh, what I'm building and doing here in real time on the mixed video output preview here. So once you're in the video tab, you're going to find a new button down here. It's towards the bottom left that says edit video overlays. Click that. This is going to bring up your edit video overlays builder here and kind of your manager of all your overlays. We're going to go ahead and clear this out. So we'll just clear. Now I save this and I'll show you how to do that too. So this is a saved overlay that I built prior to shooting this video. And we're just going to clear the list. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is hit this plus button right here. That's going to set your first layer. As you can see, it says new item text. So where you enter your text, and we'll make this a text overlay is our first option here. We'll type in PCDJ demo. Once you've typed in your text, click the set text button. So as you see, it's now showing on the preview here. Uh, you can also set the font type by clicking this button here. And this will launch the fonts that are already preloaded on your machine. So go ahead, I'll go ahead and click it. Then I'll go through a list. Looks like a pretty cool font. We'll just select the font, to bold. And after you've selected your font, the font style if ap applicable, and the size, you can just hit OK. So there we go. Now, over here, as you can see, a little square. By default, this will be white when you first start up. But I can click this, choose a color, and hit OK to apply it. Down below, you can adjust the position of the text using these little position radio dial buttons. I guess that's what they're technically called. And to the right of your position, you have size, rotation, and opacity. Size will obviously change the size of the text. Rotation will do just that. It will rotate the text. And opacity just adjusts the transparency level, how blended it is on top of the background. And obviously, you can create as many layers as you want per overlay, which is really cool and pretty unique to our system here. So for our next layer, we're going to hit plus again to open up a new layer. We'll make this one an image layer. So down below, where you see it says image or video, to the right of this, you have a choose file button. Click that. And got some assets that I have here. We'll just go in here 
and select uh, an image. I'll use this one. So you can see it right away show up. It's kind of small. So just like we did with the text, you can now change the size. I can change. We won't rotate it because I like it where it is. And we'll adjust this. And you can move up and down the position. And change the opacity. There we go. So the way the builder works actually is your top item, so, so it's clear, is actually the, the base le level. So whatever's at top is going to be your lowest level. The, the items at the bottom, the last added item, is always going to be on top. It's the way the builder works. So there we go. We got those two items. Very simple. You know, just like the text, I can – oh, I actually selected text. So if I select my – let's make this a little bit like that. If I select the text, I can rotate the background image too if I wanted to. But I kind of like it just like that. In fact, I'll make it a little bigger. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and add a third layer. This time, we will add a video. Hit the plus button once again. Just like we did before, down here where it says image or video, click the choose file button. And I'll go ahead and select this one. So we'll go ahead and make this bigger and move this up to the top so it's all the way in the background. And just to see this a little bit better, we'll change the opacity of the crowd so they're a little less visible. And and there you have it. So as you can see, this is really cool. It's like a total overlay builder. You can build as many overlays as you want, and you can save them, which I'll show you how to do right now. So I've got my overlay. I want to go ahead and save this one. Just click the button labeled Save here on the panel and name it. We'll put it in where I've chosen a folder to create these and save these. PCDJ Demo. And just hit Enter to save it. So now when you've got, and, and as I said before, we do plan to have a, a way to load these overlays right from the skin of Dex3. So by the time you're watching this video, they may already be possible. Uh, but for now, you would just click the load button and you can select your other overlay. So you can switch between them really quickly just by loading different overlays. So that's it right now. You know, there is another feature um, that is available right now that uh, we'll touch on in another video, but you can also set a custom background image for the next singer's dis display when you're hosting karaoke. So instead of just a bland black background with your three singers on screen, you can make it so that there's a nice image behind the, the next uh, three singers that it will always use anytime the next singer's display is on display. So I hope that helps. Uh, if you have any questions about how the text, video, and image overlays work in DEX 3.7 and up, please leave them in the comments section below.